Now, as we end the program, the much talk of uh, the much of the talk in Brazil might centre around the heat and difficulty in playing conditions for players on the field uh, participating in the FIFA World Cup. But compared to what some soccer stars in Scotland are up against, it's a walk in the park. Blair Moore in Scotland last Saturday and Sunday played host to the filthiest game of football that you're li ever likely to see. A bizarre sport of swamp soccer and the pinnacle of the game, the Swamp Soccer World Cup. Take a look. <laughs> the players require real guts, coordination, determination and a very good washing powder. But compared to a normal game of soccer, here it's the pitch that's the star. It takes around a day to prepare, with all grass removed before a tractor comes in and churns the ground. Hundreds of gallons of water is then added. The rules of the game are also a little left field. Players are prohibited from changing their shoes during the game, while corner kicks, penalties and throw-ins are taken by a drop kick. Organizers of the Swamp Soccer World Cup, Stuart Miller, said it was a straightforward game to play. The sport is fast becoming a worldwide phenomenon, said to originate in the swamps of Finland, where athletes reportedly found it to be an excellent means of training for cross-country skiing. Swamp soccer tournaments are now held across the globe in countries including Brazil, Holland, China, and later this year, India. Ideal sunny conditions saw the weekend 16 tournament teams packing their home and away kit for a dirty weekend. The championship was open to everyone over the age of 17 years old, with teams of all male and mixed. Teams including Mud, Sweat and Beers, Mud Watch, Real Mankey and Whitby Walrosses were made up of six players, though they were allowed to draw on an unlimited supply of substitutes throughout the match, which lasts 24 minutes. Players must then continue to move as the alternative, after all, is to sink into the bog. The two-day tournament drew to its climax on Sunday afternoon in bright sunshine. Well, how much fun you think they could be having squirming around in all that mud and taking a really scrubby shower after that. Um, thanks for watching The World Today. I am Amaracho Bunny. There will be more coming up in Sports News. Please stay with us.